Hi everybody. Now, a question I've been asked a lot recently is why have you not posted any YouTube videos in ages? Now, one of the reasons is I've not had much time to actually get around to doing the editing. And number two is this is the temporary video file drive from my computer. So this is basically where I empty all my memory cards onto so then uh, do some video processing. Um, it's partially backed up, um, but all the recent stuff I emptied off, so basically I took all my, a big stack of memory cards, uh, copied them all across, and then it pretty much failed straight away after I'd finished copying everything. So I lost all my recent video files. Uh, this is basically stopped working. It's making a clicking and buzzing noise. Um, so, I mean, it sounds like it's spinning, so it sounds like the heads are not able to uh, operate correctly. Uh, now, I know this is not a clean room and this is not advisable, uh, but I'm not paying hundreds of pounds to have data recovery, so I'm going to basically open it up and have a quick look to see if it's completely failed. If the disc's all scratched up or something, it's not even worth me trying anything, but if it looks in good condition, it may be worth seeing if we can get this thing to work. Right, so before I actually take the drive apart, I thought I'd take a look at the controller board. Now, look at the edge connector here. I assume this is some sort of factory test connector. But look how corroded it is. Now, I have no idea why there'd be any corrosion, as this, this hard drive has been owned by me from new, and it's been kept completely dry inside a computer. It's never been damp or any reason for there to be any corrosion at all. And that header over there is also uh, looking corroded. So I've just pulled the screws out. Let's have a look at the contact pads. So, motor contact pads are there. Oh, they're corroded. <laughs> and then that goes to the head assembly. And oh, look, they are all corroded. What the hell? In fact, it's nothing, nothing else on the board is corroded. So everything looks fine. It's where they've got this gold plating. It's like the plating has failed. How rubbish is that? Oh yeah, a lot around the screw holes as well, it's all looking all flaky. So it seems to be they've like applied a selective gold plating process during the PC manufacture and that, that coating is completely failing. So I wonder if it's worth... So the gold contacts on this side are okay. I wonder if it's worth trying to clean that up with a fiberglass pen. I'm going to do that first, I can't believe that. It really does look like that's in bad condition. Right, so I had to go on the back of the board first just to see what the results would be like, and it looks like I can clean all that coating off quite easily. It is just literally flaking off. I'll just use a fiberglass pencil. And I'm just going to flip it over now and clean up these pads because they look terrible. Well, I don't know if this is going to fix it or not, but they've uh, certainly cleaned up nicely, and it's worth a try. And fingers crossed, please work. Well, I don't have massively high hopes for this, but let's find out what happens. Spinning up. Nah, it's doing the clicking. Don't know how well that picks up on the camera. Well, unfortunately, we've got more serious problems than the corroded connections on the board. Alright, let's pull it out and take a look inside. Right, so I've taken out the screws and I've peeled back the labels. We'll have a look. Okay, I don't see any big scratches on the drive. Does it spin? Yeah, it spins very smoothly. So no motor problem. Uh, the heads are parked. Do they move? They do. Okay. I wonder if it's just a head failure then. I think it might be worth me buying a second drive and seeing if we can do some transplanting.